Okay, what about this one? So, this one has an area of one. Okay. And it has one dot in, on it. But okay. no dots in it. This dot is one. So interesting. So this one actually has, when you, when you look at the vertices, this one has... It's one, it's one dot other than the vertices. One dot other than the vertices. Okay, so that's interesting. But it has an area of one. Yeah, but so. it has an, this one has an area of one. Mm -hmm. Can you find any other triangles that have an area of one? Well, maybe we can do the same thing and maybe move it out further. Because this one has a dot in it. Okay, now that's a very interesting change. Because this one, it has a dot in it still. So this one has a height of two. two. And it still has a base of one. A base of one, but it still has that, an extra dot involved in it. Hmm. What about here? Okay. Uh -huh. What about this? What's going on here? Now we have a this dot here. That dot there. Yeah. Okay. If we move it out further, we get this dot inside. Which one is inside? It's this dot here. Okay. So I have a little question about this assumption that that all the triangles that have area one or all all triangles with one dot in them have area one. Okay. So what if you have a triangle that looks like oh wait. Oops. Nah. It was, I was just thinking of another triangle. It was in this one. Okay. What one were you thinking of? It was just a different version of this one. Okay. But there, there are triangles that, are there triangles that have area like three halves and have one dot in them? Okay. Because you could look at, you could look at this triangle. It has a right, yeah, base, there's a base of three and a height of one. Okay. But it has two dots. It has two Even though the area is not two. Uh -huh. Aha. What did the area what happened to the area? Well, it increased by a half. Yeah. It increased so by a half. Maybe every time you add a dot, your area increases by a half. Interesting. Now where are these these extra dots here? Where are these extra well, dots? They're on In the line. Okay. Yeah, they're just on it. On the it's on the edge. Yeah, the, the lines right. between So the here we're edges. increasing the number of dots on the perimeter. Okay. When we started with zero, we were at a half. Here. One extra dot on the perimeter. Area was? It was one. Two extra dots on the perimeter. The area is one half. One three half. halves. Three extra dots on the perimeter. The area would be two now. So what's your hypothesis about increasing the number of dots on the perimeter? Well, the area would be the number of dots on the perimeter plus um, one. Would it be time? So well, the number of dots on the perimeter. So there's, there's three dots on the perimeter and the area here is two. Well, we, we should be careful because the dots that are the vertices are dots. also on the perimeter. So how many dots does that triangle so you, have on the perimeter? technically have six dots. And what's Maybe its area? The number of dots other than two. the vertices, that's other than the vertices on the perimeter. Maybe. Well, you, the, here it's divided by three. Okay. All right, well, let's, let's, go, um, let's go back to our whiteboard and try to write down some data here. All right. Okay.